Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to install a free YouTube music desktop app. So if you like to listen to your music on uh, YouTube and you don't like using your web browser to do so, you could download this free app. So it's pretty simple to install. There is one thing you need to do first and that's you need to install Winget in order to run this command here. So if you click on install Winget up here, it'll download an executable that you could run to install it and then it'll be on your computer for anything else you want to install. Uh, because once you come to this website here, you can browse all the different packages uh, for other apps that you might want to check out. Okay, so once you have Winget installed, you just simply copy this command here, paste it into a command prompt window, like so. I already have it installed, so let me close it here. Maybe it'll reinstall it, so you can see how it works. Okay, so it's already installed, so it's not going to do it again, but I just wanted to show you that it's super easy to do. You just paste in the command, press enter, and it'll do the rest. All right, so now let me open up the program here. Then of course you could sign in with your Google account to have your playlist in your library. So this is just a test account, so I don't really have anything going on here. So you have your home, uh, you could do your searches, it has some suggestions to get you started, soundtracks, and this type of thing. And you have the explore section here. So if you want to check out new releases, top charts, podcasts, new albums, select a certain genre here, TV shows, and so on. And then at the top here, you have your settings, general settings here, you know, start on boot, that type of thing, uh, appearance, playback options, continue where you left off, that's a nice feature, integrations, and shortcuts. So if I do shift P, that'll be play pause. And then if you don't like the shortcut, you could delete it. Just make sure you don't uh, set up a shortcut that's used for something else because you might run into problems with that. All right, so as you can see, it's you know pretty easy to set up and it has some nice features and it's a nice alternative to using the uh, YouTube website. So once again, just go to the link here, which I'll put in the description, install Winget, copy and paste this command into a command prompt, and then you should have the app installed. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.